I hereby christen the spirit of Nanaimo. This year, the tubbing experience was extra special as Nanaimoites witnessed the launching of the new world's largest bathtub and the retiring of the old faithful, unseaworthy after 15 years of service. Now, the construction actually began with the acquisition of two hulls and engines from vessels which had some unfortunate accident. But the work itself was completed by community-minded individuals, some professionals, but mostly a year and a half of concentrated effort to save the spirit of Nanaimo. The new world's largest bathtub will continue to promote Nanaimo and tourism for many years to come. Fun, sun, and lots of smiles were everywhere to be found during 1987 bathtub festivities. Officially opened by Prime Minister Brian Mulroney in a ceremony held at Swayalana Lagoon. Uh, families and uh, community coming together, summertime, good times. Uh, this is about a country that is becoming more united, a country that's uh, a little bit fairer, a little more tolerant, a little more prosperous. And I'm delighted. Uh, there will be no politics from me, but I can tell you that I am delighted when I see British Columbia getting its fair share in the national economy. And that's good news for all. Weather conditions today a little gray. Uh, there is a bit of chop out in the Straits of Georgia, but an hour or so earlier we went out and uh, there's a good strong southeast wind blowing 15 to 20 knots, which may have a, a determining factor in this race. Uh, it may pick up, it may die down. It's hard to say at this point. And here we go, the start of the 1987 great race to Vancouver, as we have this great vantage point from Swile on a lagoon and in the air with these tubbers leaving the harbor at this point. Of course, we'll be looking for uh, the first tupper to plunge or fall into the drink here in Nanaimo. An award goes that way. A couple of tuppers not even making the start uh, just earlier, swamping before the start of the race. And here, here we see our current leader, young Dave Bradshaw from Victoria, as he's pounding out his northerly route to Vancouver in very rough waters indeed, probably the roughest I've seen in many years. As he's moving ahead, he's really taking a pounding. Our winner last year, Craig Bunch, is out of the race. He's in the water, really having a tough time with his tub. Our 1987 race reads like an adventure novel. Our current leader is out of gas and sitting in Kitsilano Harbor. His name is Wayne Nakatani. Here we're looking at Dave Bradshaw, who led the race most of the way, but he is so far north at this point, his uh, forward momentum stopping at times and having to go back to Nanaimo to pick up speed. Wayne Nakatani moving in now, hitting the beach just under three hours. What a great race, and he's going to be sprinting up the beach to get to the bell, and if he can find his land legs, there he is, out in that rough water for over three hours almost. 